Good morning. How is everybody? Nor my little Rudolph knows we got going on. I have got some fun things to tell you about. So the numbers, what am I talking about? 10-1, October 1st. That is the launch of our new concealer. I have been playing with some makeup this morning, so bear with me while I try and find where I've set it down. All right, this is our new Unique Touch Skin Solution Concealer. It's amazing. It is um, more coverage than our regular concealer. It's not kind of, it's not sticky or dewy or anything like that as the other concealer. It dries to matte like our foundation. It comes in 20 colors. We've added, this is Scarlet that I have, but we've added a new lighter color. Scarlet is more of a um, pink or neutral tone. I'd say more of a neutral tone. And then we've added a lighter color, Marcuset, which is, I'm gonna say it's also a, it's more of a neutral yellowish undertone. Um, but, so 10-1, that's that number. 20, that's the number of colors it comes in. Um, I am taking pre-orders, so I can go ahead and hop in line on 10-1 and y'all don't have to worry about anything. Uh, but that's what we're gonna showcase today. While I'm chatting, I'm gonna go ahead and spray with, I've got lavender I think I picked up. No, I picked up cucumber, right? Cucumber. I had them all right here. And then I'm gonna grab my mattifying primer hands were shaking I had too much coffee and put that on and kind of let it do its thing while we're chatting all right 10 1 20 what was the 60 now I threw myself off on that well heck I don't know um what in the world what am I talking about I don't know y'all just bear with me I'm so excited heard all my stuff written out and now I hadn't had enough coffee to figure out what I'm talking about let's go with the concealer good morning miss tamara all right let's so let's see this concealer look at this so you know we love a doe foot applicator but look how large that one is hey maggie all right let me compare it to another one of our doe foot applicators oh 60 hello that was the new announcement this morning for every 60 dollars you spend from now until monday you get a free ba -ba -ba -da twisted mascara that's the two wands in one so like say you bought something and it added up to 60 you get a free twisted ma mascara say you bought stuff worth 120 you get two twisted mascaras you could do that all the way up to 10 but what once you get to whatever that would be you can't get any more which okay don't don't spend that much on makeup I love you all but don't do that um so this is the other hey Kim doe foot so that's our normally sized doe foot applicator and then here's our baby, our new baby, doe foot applicator. Look at that, it's so nice. It's got the little suction stuff in there, so when you pull it out, it takes off, you know, so you're not covered in it. All right, so that was the 10 one, October 1st. Comes in 20 colors. The 60, hey Nicole, is the 60 for one. That's where the 60 and the one come in. I'm so glad I remember that. I had so many things going in my head. All right, so let's get started. I'm going to dot. I'm going to dot over here. Definitely gonna cover my little Rudolph issue we got going on. And I, I've been doing some makeup demonstrations this morning, so I have washed my face multiple times, so hence the little redness we've got because I've been scrubbing it. Well, that sounded bad, not roughly or anything. Y'all know I have veiny eyes, if you eyelids if you watch, so I'm gonna dot it there. So this is Scarlet. It would be lighter than what I would normally use for a foundation. Um, but people are wearing an ass foundation. So like say I would wear Organza right now. I could buy it in Organza and just wear it as a foundation since it dries to a powder finish. I'm gonna take my blending bud. This is clean. I know it doesn't look like it, but it's just from use. I'm gonna grab I call everything rose water, but I know it's cucumber flavor. And it's flavor is not the right word, but that's what I call it. So we're gonna squirt it so it's a little damp. I just did one, and we're just gonna dab. So when I used this the other day, I did not have any primer on, and I used my hands, and I did a lot. Like, I put it on super thick, because I had no idea how much coverage this, this gave, okay? And it gives a lot. 
I mean, look, already. Isn't that crazy? Y'all, I don't know if y'all remember or if y'all were around when we had Bittersweet, the um, splurge that was kind of like a coral or a salmon-y color. And that's what we would put under the eyes before putting on the makeup to help get your dark circles gone because orange cancels out like blue and black. I don't know why, but it does. Um, I mean, that does it without anything. I'm gonna turn it to the big side and squirt the big end because that's taking too long. And personally, I'm a brush wearer, but I saw somebody use their, I mean a brush user, use their little blending bud. So let's swap because that's driving me nuts. I set it down, I gotta find the brush, here we go. So I'm gonna take the foundation brush. I'm gonna squirt it too because it's, it's like a little damp. I'm just gonna pat, I'm not gonna drag, I'm not gonna pull. Actually, I'm gonna have to because it dries pretty quickly, kind of like the spray foundation. So I've been chit-chatting too much and starting to get a little dry. But I'm gonna show y'all. And yes, it's lighter, but that's what you want because when we put our other makeup on, we want it to highlight through and make our eyes pop. Any kind of those um, dull areas, we want them to pop. Look, and do you see, it's not settling into my lines. Yes, I have lines. I might have to pull this one a little bit because it dried. But did you see that, how it sticks? Once it dries, this baby's not going anywhere. But you won't be chit-chatting on a video when you do this on a normal day, okay? Do you see that? Stinking amazing. I'm just pulling this up so it kind of blends it in. All right. So, what do we want to put over it? Let's go. Let's go spray today. So that's also in the kudos is um, any foundation of choice, any primer of choice, any face brush of choice. So I'm gonna shake it. Here's a little roller ball. I've got velour. I'm gonna take my kabuki brush and let's just spray it. Hold on, got a hair twisted up in it. Oh my goodness, I didn't grab it. There we go. You can always go back and add more. It too is gonna dry quickly. So I'm gonna shut my mouth for a minute and I'm gonna blend it in. I'm gonna pat on my nose because that's where my little Rudolph thing is and I didn't want to pull any of the makeup off of it. Make sure you go down your neck. I mean, holy moly Coroli, right? I'm just in love with it. We didn't, I mean, I had to because I had Scarlet and it wasn't my makeup color, but you totally would not have to put makeup on over that concealer if you just did it all over with the, for your regular makeup. So that was, so if you were, if we were doing the kudos, that would be the mattifying primer, the kabuki brush, and then I did velour spray. And I actually have a velour spray on hand if anybody's interested in that. And then the concealer, which we did underneath, it's 29, so 32 plus tax. Um, and then I would just order for you come October 1st. So now just for kicks, I like to put the translucent setting powder over the spray. Um, I just like the feel of the powder. It's got the little springy thing, so we're gonna do that. And just all over. And it's just real light. Like I'm not really touching my face, if that makes any sense. I'm very just lightly dusting over it. It's translucent. Even if it looks a little light, give it about, two, oh my goodness. Give us about, hey Riley, give us about two minutes while we're chit chatting and stuff. And it's gonna adjust to my skin tone, okay? It's the magical part of the unique world. All right, so I'm gonna take, let's 
see what I want to take. I just love our blush and Surreal. I always thought it was purple and I always avoided buying it. And now it's my favorite, or one of my favorites. I've got lots. All right, so I'm gonna take one of our little brushes. It's a mushroom top brush. It's one of our beachfront, I'm trying to read it, it's kind of come off. It's just called a beachfront large brush. But it's the same thing as our um, tapered blusher brush. It was just handier. Of course, now I've got both of them in my hands, but what else? Everything is highly pigmented, so it doesn't take much. Excuse me. Y'all be sure to share this if you don't mind. Get the word out about our deals going on right now. That would be awesome. Hope everybody's doing good out there too in COVID world. All right, so I just did a little bit around so it's not like so white around the edges of my face. But y'all look at that coverage, isn't that awesome? And then you know we're gonna showcase the twisted while we're here. So let's take, I'm gonna grab our brow palette. And I'm gonna grab my brow brush. So it's got two ends. It's got the flat end and it's got the tapered end. And then I have the blonde eyebrow palette. Once again, I'm gonna wet it. I'm by my sink, but I have lights in it right now. So I might like dip it in just like a little dot of water, but I'm gonna spray it with my cucumber water since I've got that handy. I'm gonna brush these guys out. And these are numbered, so they tell you what to do. One, two, three, and four. So I'm gonna take one, and one, I'm gonna cheat and look at this mirror over here, but when you take color one, that's like when you're doing an outline of your eyebrows or the shape that you want. You can do whatever shape. Mine, I have to fill in from plucking them for 5,000 years. I kind of gave it a shape. Let's do the other side. Hey, Kip. And if you mess up or you get out of the shape that you want, not a big deal. All right, so let's go on to color number two, and I'm gonna flip it around to the flat side. Two is a little darker, and that's just to fill in the middle of whatever you made the shape that you want, okay? And it's gonna look a little heavy at first, but hold tight, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna go back. You've got two choices here. You can use a, I actually don't know the technical term, hold on. A lash comb and brush. Or I've got the little lash brush on the end of our lash liner. Or the one that I really like too is the Spoolie Brow Artist Brush. So it's got the, oh, that's got dust on it, but it has the um, angled and then it has the Spoolie Brush. And so what I like to do with that, once you put it in, you just kind of lightly, you're brushing, but it blends and it softens. So see, like, see how there's that dark mark right there? Watch this. We're gonna soften it up. See? But you're like, hey, Stacy, this one looks a little fatter than this one. Well, first of all, they're not twins. Just kidding. Second of all, let's fix that. Let's go back. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, hey, Heather, I mean, it's hilarious, but you know, when you do it all the time, it's like nothing. Now, could I, you know, whatever, Yellow, it's fun, keep watching. So these actually are for highlighting up on your brow bone, but they're also magic erasers, okay? It's like, what? All right, so let's take the pink. Pink, that's what I said. I'm putting it on my brush, okay? Watch this. So I don't want it this thick right here. Hey, Gigi. Hey, Amy. So did you see that? You see this little guy right here where we got out? Hello, bye-bye. Isn't that amazing? I don't know how it does it. 
Amy, you're missing on my fun words. I didn't have any words this morning. See, why not? Now let's go on to the fun part. So we did the concealer. I showed the new concealer. You need it, you want it, you'll love it. And if you don't, you know what? You have 30 days to try it anyways, and then I can fix you up. Let's go twisted. Because from today until Monday, for every $60 you spend, you get a free twisted mascara. So I'm gonna go with the lash primer first. I do love it. I think it makes a huge difference. Yes, I thought it was a scam. I knew nothing about a lash primer before this, but I love it. And now when I wear mascara, I don't wear mascara without it. It's white and we're gonna put it on just like we would normal mascara, okay? It's gonna help you see all your lashes, first of all. So when you go to put on mascara, you're getting more coverage because you're actually covering more lashes. It helps separate them and it gives them a little bit of thickness. So instead of your mascara just going on a thin little eyebrow, uh, eyelash, sorry, gotta go, doctor's appointment. Okay. Um, it gives you some volume. Okay, let's re dip and go to the other. So that's gonna dry for a second. While that dries, let's do some lips before we go to the twisted, okay? I am gonna take our liquid eyeshadows because I love them. And let's see what we wanna play with today. I'm gonna go, can you see that? It's backwards and upside down. Exalted and giggly. Let me find my little brushes. So I'm gonna take the exalted first and I've got this so I can not mixed colors, okay? So it does, it also has the little doe foot applicator, so that's nice. But I'm gonna use this fake, or non-unique little doe foot applicator. Not fake, whatever. And I'm just kind of lining with the tip of the applicator. Or giving some definition, that's the word I'm looking for. Okay. It's already dried, powder finished. Just like everything else, the um, <sighs> liquid eyeshadows, the liquid foundation, the concealer. They go on liquid and then dry to a powder matte finish. Won't smear, won't smudge, won't crease, all that fun stuff. So that is like a, it's not coral. It's like a pinky shimmer champagne. It's gorgeous. So I got that one. Amanda. All right, so then let's take this giggly and we're gonna do a little ombre in the middle, okay? So I'm gonna take another one of my little doe fit applicators. You can buy like a million of these for like three bucks on Amazon. Okay, so I got Giggly, it's a light pink. And I've got on black today, which is nothing new, but I love pink and black. So, we're gonna put it just in the middle. I would use Reverent probably, but that's on loan right now. So, we're gonna do it just in the middle. And see, I'm doing that. I mean, I guess you don't have to make that noise, but it's fun. Um, it's dry already. But now you have a little ombre. I do like, good morning Paige. I do like a gloss finish. Um, so let me grab, and you can use any gloss you have. You can use a chapstick. You can use, I, I'm a sucker for a Bath and Body Works lip balm. You can use anything actually to give you that. But I'm gonna use one of the lip glosses that I have on hand, Lunar. It's kind of like a gold shimmer, so it's not really going to change the color. But I am going to use one more, just because I try all these on different folks, so I never use the same thing. All right, and we're just going to put it all over. But see, it didn't smudge it because it's already dried. Let me get another one. I want more coat. Yes, and then you 
got a little ombre look. And obviously, you could make it more pronounced if you wanted to. Thank you, girlfriend. But um, that's what we're going with. Now, since our lash primer is dry, let's take our Twisted. This is what you can get for free with every 60 right now. Queenie! All right, so we've got two wands in this one. Here's the big guy. Let me put it in front of my forehead so you can see. It is shorter, thicker, denser, okay? Now watch this. We're gonna unscrew this part, and that's where the smaller one is. So that's, it's, these are not rubber, that's more of um, like a hair type of bristle. All right, so I'm gonna put them back together because this has, I don't know if we can see, hold on, let's see if we can figure this out. Do you see how it's got the hole in the middle? So when you put the small wand inside the big wand, you're still able to get, um, yes, Queenie, um, you're able to get, I'm sorry, I was reading a text that was coming through, um, mascara onto both wands at the same time. So you don't have to dip one and then dip the other. So I screwed them back together, putting them in. So Queenie, lash primer, it goes on white. It's amazing. I didn't know I needed it in my life, but I did. And now I only wear mascara with it, white. I don't know if you can see it or not. All right, so let's take, I'm gonna screw it all the way on, hold the silver, and I'm just gonna bring out the little one. And I'm gonna look in my other mirror, and I'm gonna use the small one and just apply all the way. This, the small one will allow you to get the teeny tiny lashes, the corners, which I love, anything like that. So that's just with the one wand. Hello. All right, let's do the other side. And since the lash primer is on there, you can see what parts you're missing and what parts need more coverage and all that kind of fun stuff. Yeah, you'll have to give it a try next time you order, Miss Queenie. Um, I was telling them, Twisted is, it's a free deal right now. For every 60 you spend, you get a free. So, say you bought something worth 60, then you get a free Twisted. It just automatically adds itself to your cart. If you did 120, you get two, all the way up to 10. But I told people, please don't buy that much makeup. I mean, I guess you could. But don't do that. Not during COVID time, please. All right, I just put myself in the eyeball. That's okay. All right, so that's just with the one. So I'm going to put it back. And I'm going to unscrew the big one together, okay? And I'm going to pull it out slowly. And then I'm just kind of going from the middle out. I'm not going all the way to the base. I need foundation, we will tell you. You got it, that's in our um, special right now. The kudos is any primer, any foundation, any brush. Obviously, you can just do the foundation, but just so you know, it's like 30 and 30 and 30 versus 40, 40 and whatever it usually is. So that's the two. And then I'm just gonna finish off with the little wand so I can um, separate. There's like a little, not a clump, but I just want to separate over there. So I'm going to finish it off one more time with the little one. And I love my corners, so I would play with getting mascara on those corners all day long. Hey, Jamie! So let's finish that off. So voila! And now look, the translucent powder has adjusted. You can't see it. The concealer is concealing. The twisted is doing its twister. All right, so last thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna do some eyeliner, but I'm not gonna use 
our stick or the liquid. Let's see what I've got handy. I'm gonna go back to the brow palette since that's what I've got right here. And that's the good thing about all of our stuff. You can use just about anything. We even have, did I set it out? The Willed, that doesn't look brown, but it is. The liquid eyeshadow, which you could technically use for an eyeliner too, because you know it's gonna dry to a powder matte finish, so why not? All right, so I'm gonna go back also to the brow brush since I've got it right here. All right, I'm gonna spray it also just to get it a little damp because I want the liner darker. And I'm gonna go with that number two because it's dark. Just dab my brush in it, that's all I'm doing. Just dab, dab, dab. All right, and then I'm gonna, I turned it so the angle's like that and I'm gonna go from the inside, watch, I'm gonna go middle first, middle out. And I turned it so I can use the tip. I'm gonna blink. Blink when it's not attached to your eyeball. I mean, your brush. And now I'm just kinda evening it out. See? It's gonna be soft, softly lined. No hard, harsh lining. And so it just blends easily. And then I'm gonna take what's left on the brush and just kind of smudge it underneath. Okay, so what if you're like, well, that's too much smudge. I gotcha. These are my new Q-tips of choice. Sorry. You just take it before it dries all the way. Lou's well, got that little, hey Olivia! Takes that little point, and look, nowhere else, just that little point, so you're not smudging it more or anything. But look at the difference, just a little bit of liner, and technically it is the eyebrow one that I used. But you're like, hey, that's not even up there. That's okay. You just smudge it, and then it doesn't matter. Now it is. Nothing has to be perfect. Okay, so let's do the other side. But look at the difference that makes. Just with a little bit of liner. It's going to give it just a little bit more pop. And it's it's just nice. Do I do it all the time? No. If you live in the same town with me, you know I don't wear makeup all the time either. But when you do, now you know some tricks. And this is my left side, so I've got to use both hands. Excuse moi. All right, so we got it on that. We're gonna smudge it underneath. I'm gonna take a clean Q-tip, the pointed ones. And just kind of, see, I just kind of even it out a little bit. Thanks for joining me. Check out the numbers. If you missed it in the beginning, I had a little brain lapse and I couldn't remember what all my numbers were. But 10-1, the concealer pre-order, I can order for you. Taking pre-orders now. It comes in 20 colors. That's the 20. 60 is you spend 60. And then the one is you get for every 60, you get a one free twisted mascara through Monday. I hope you have a great weekend. College football is back. Hallelujah. Makes my heart happy. Y'all have a great weekend, and I shall see you soon. Let me know if I can help you with anything. Bye.